active. He had a bit prior to Straight Blaze being a scratching. That'll give Hey Cisco a bit of galloping room in box three now with the vacant box inside. Like a newy lady. Some hope as well. Green light goes on. There's no more bets. We're set to go. Oh, way up there, Billy began in well, but then Hockenewe Lady just copped a little check or stumbled out of the boxes. Favourites trying to get some room, getting squeezed up by Corborn Cross. He goes to the outside, tries to. On the inside, hey, Cisco, now Land of Promise. Favourite in trouble. Land of Promise coming in. Land of Promise too good. Beats hey, Cisco. Uh, third, either Victor Mikey or Hockenewe Lady. Up there, Billy had a check of passage all the way up the straight with Hot Rocks and Corborn Cross, and the run was around 16.90. David Punters didn't have the best of that one. Up there, Billy began not too bad, but then got was the meat and the sandwich between Victor Mikey, who wanted to get to the outside, and Corborn Cross, who wanted to get to the inside, was starting to push through, but then really got the squeeze up, and that was history for the favourite. And Land of Promise just charged through. It's 1354, 1354. 1354, the judges' numbers. 1692 was the time. One, three, five, and four after race five. One and a half by one. And a promise takes first prize. 1692, the official time. One and a half by one. Black Bitch, trained by Scott Felder. She's by Banjo Boy out of Whitney Showgirl. And was 2.50.